Good evening. Arson investigators are combing through a house in the Heights, trying to figure out how and why the owner set it on fire three times in less than 24 hours. The homeowner is in jail, not for the fires, but for what he did to one of the firefighters. Here's News 13's Alex Tomlin. Dig Jessica, online court records show only a few minor traffic tickets in Gary Mickey's past, but investigators say Mickey is in a lot of trouble tonight after a bizarre 24 hours. There was smoke everywhere and it was the neighbor's house. Neighbors were startled last night when this home on La Vida near San Mateo and Indian School caught fire. Flames that were on the top of the roof three or four feet high. They were coming out from the back of the house. News 13 was there as firefighters quickly put out the bedroom blaze. But this morning, firefighters found themselves right back out at the same house. The fire was in the kitchen area. Firefighters downed those flames only to be called out a third time for another bedroom fire just after noon. Altogether, we had three different uh, fires in three different areas of the of the house. Neighbors on this quiet street say Gary Mickey is going through a rough patch and a stressful separation from his wife. He's trying to make some sort of statement, and I don't know what that is. Other neighbors say Mickey has seemed off lately. He seemed like a nice guy, but now that I hear all this, it's like a big old. Well, he kind of looked like I don't know. Something that makes his behavior even more strange, the way he acted the third time firefighters came out to his home. When one of the firefighters started questioning Mickey, the occupant suddenly got upset and assaulted one of our firefighters. Officials say Mickey punched the firefighter in the face. Officers hauled him off to jail. Neighbors say they aren't worried about Mickey, but do worry the next time he starts a fire, it could spread to their homes. You can't control ashes and that sort of thing. So yeah, that's definitely a concern. As you can see, the home does have a lot of vis visible damage. Investigators won't say how Mickey started the fires yet. A neighbor told me Mickey's wife wants to fix the damage and sell the home. Jessica? Okay, Alex, as far as the firefighter who took a punch to the face, he's okay.